In 2016, for the second year in a row, no black actors were nominated for an Oscar. The outrage was palpable. Organisers vowed to do better and there has been sweeping reform to nomination criteria and Academy membership. For actor in a leading role, Riz Ahmed, Chadwick Boseman. Five years down the line and nearly half of the nominees for the top acting awards are not white. For the first time, two women, Chloe Zhao and Emerald Fennell, are up for Best Director. Riz Ahmed is the first Muslim to be nominated for Best Actor and Stephen Yeun is the first Asian American shortlisted in the same category. The push has come really from competition from the um, digital platforms like Netflix, like Amazon. Uh, who have begun to actually put serious amounts of money into more diverse output, um, more uh, risky productions that have been successful and have left Hollywood looking uh, really like um, uh, an old relic. Uh, and I think, uh, obviously, Hollywood itself has had to up its game. Daddy, daddy, please come home to me. But the battle for equality is far from over. If you look at the pay of female actresses of colour, it's not at the same levels as, say, the uh, white equivalents. If you look at the actual uh, money that's put into distribution, marketing and advertising, um, there are still uh, differences. Reporters keep asking me, really, why you do the things you do? This is what I tell him. Andra Day, who's nominated for Best Actress for her performance in the United States vs. Billie Holiday, says it's important the Academy doesn't rest on this year's laurels. I'm sure you're aware that there are a lot of black stories that have been, most of them, that have been suppressed and that have been manipulated and twisted so that we don't know the full depth of our struggle, our contribution and our triumph. So marginalised people need to be they need a platform and the stories need to be told and I'd like to, to, to be a hand. I'm a servant, so that's what I'd like to be. The Black Panthers are forming a rainbow coalition of oppressed brothers and sisters of every color. Stories that historically have been ignored have been recognised this year, but some fear that's only because the release of high-budget blockbusters was delayed while the pandemic kept cinemas closed, which means we may have to wait until next year to find out if the industry really has achieved deep-rooted change. Sarah Morris, TRT World.